Hello Pisces and welcome to your February 2019. How do they feel about you, Reedy? We are going to see how this person is feeling <clears throat> and if they will take any action in regards to those feelings. All right. Pisces, February 2019. How do they feel about Pisces? How do they feel? How do they feel? Ooh, we have past life relationship. You have known each other before, so they feel very close to you. They feel very warm towards you. They feel like your souls um, are connected, possibly even have like a, a soul contract. They feel like things are meant to be here and they want you to give them a chance. Give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. They want to work on this. They feel this connection to you like no other, and they, they want things to happen here between the two of you. This is for Pisces. Let's see what the tarot has to say. February 2019. How do they feel about Pisces? If this resonates with you, Pisces, please like, share, and subscribe, and leave me a comment. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. If this does not resonate with you at all, Pisces, please check your moon, your rising, and your Venus sign as this will not resonate with every Pisces out there. Please keep in mind that some of the energies can be vice versa or interchangeable, so however, it resonates with you. This is for Pisces. This is for Pisces for February 2019. How do they feel about Pisces? How do they feel about Pisces? Wow. Okay, so a lot of hidden emotions here. I feel like it's been very back and forth passionate but very back and forth between the two of you. They want to make it more steady. I don't think they have revealed um, all of their emotions to you. I think that is the main purpose of this moon card. A lot of hidden emotions here. They have not told you how strongly they feel the connection is for one thing. Now this could also be a hidden relationship. This could also be, you know, uh, secret decisions having to be made, that kind of thing. But the most prominent thing here is they have not revealed to you just how deep their emotions are for you, okay? But they want to. And that, of course, is your card right there. So we have this wish fulfillment card. This is one of the happiest cards of the tarot deck, right? You are their wish fulfillment. And what they are truly desiring here, Pisces, is for you to open up to them emotionally. Tell them how you feel. They want to open up their emotions to you and tell you how they feel, okay? And let you know that they feel that this connection is just out of this world, like crazy strong. They feel like you are the one they feel like your souls are intertwined and have been through this lifetime and previous lifetimes right they want you to just give them a shot here i feel like it's been very back and forth very hot and cold um for whatever reason we have this knight of wands here this is fire of course aries leo and sagittarius but this has been a very back and forth kind of relationship running hot and cold hot and cold they really want to work on this okay they are not only in love with you and i'm just going to put that out there because they are they feel that kind of connection here but they are also very passionate about you and they want to stabilize the situation we have this king of pinnacles here this is earth this is Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. They want to come in 
and make serious offers and kind of settle this back and forth energy down and turn it into a, a stable long-term relationship that is the offer that they want to give you right that is the um and it doesn't have to be an earth sign it male or female absolutely doesn't matter this is the energy of the card so this is you know somebody wanting to stabilize this back and forth hot and cold energy somebody wanting to open up emotionally somebody wanting to um take that next step uh make it serious right uh, it's very well thought out, well planned, and they they want to make it happen. They want to work on this and take it to another level. All right, Pisces. Let's see what other information we can get for you. February 2019. How do they feel? How do they feel about Pisces? What actions will they take for Pisces? This is for Pisces. Yeah, they're they're waiting on the right time here. Okay, so the the goal here is this 10 of cups commitment with you Pisces. They want a happy partnership. They want a happy family. They want a happy home life. They want to live with you. They want to share their life with you. They want to be in a blissful, loving relationship with you. Ten of Cups, that's water, energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. That is the goal. Um, they're waiting. They're waiting for the right time. Okay? The right time to tell you. The right time... Um, I feel like there's some obstacles that may need to be cleared up before we can have this truthful conversation about how serious they want to make this relationship. We have um, the Three of Wands. This is more fire energy, right? So this is, you know, decisions have been made. So you got the Two of Wands and now we're at the Three of Wands, right? So they're solid in their decision and they're just waiting for the right time they're making plans they could travel to see you they they're making plans here okay they're looking out into their future and seeing how it's going to look with you in it and they like that and they're waiting for you to um, get on board with this all right let's settle this energy down Let's make a solid commitment here. Now, this is very slow moving, right? We have the Page of Pentacles here. They may test the waters here to see how you're going to react. Like, it's almost like a trickle. They may, um, see, this isn't a big offer like that King of Pentacles, right? This is what I feel is hidden. Um, so, But they're going to take it very slowly here with you. They don't want to scare you off. They just want to kind of see how you're going to react. It's like a little bit at a time with this page of pentacles, right? More earth energy. But this is still a very grounding energy. So they may just kind of give you just a little bit to see what your reaction is going to be towards them, right? Because they feel like there's a lot of dishonesty here. Not saying, you know, dishonest behavior. I just feel like this is people keeping their emotions in. Not being 100% honest in regards to their emotion here. Right? They feel like you're hiding a lot of emotion from them. And they are definitely, you know, testing the waters on how you're going to react to the emotion um, that they, they want to give you, right? How are you going to react? They're not going to be completely forthright and just put it out all on the line here. They want to. But they're kind of nervous about the situation. So they're just going to trickle in and see how you're going to react to it. All right, Pisces. 
So they're waiting, they're planning, and they want to settle down this back and forth hot and cold energy. They want to open up emotionally to you. That is their wish. You are their wish, Pisces, okay? So that is what's going on with you for February 2019 for your How Do They Feel About You reading. I hope you have enjoyed it. I go live Sunday through Thursday with the daily message around noon Eastern Standard Time. And then um, Friday is the live Love Lester Loss, also around noon Eastern Standard Time. So check all that out. Next week, I'll be getting out the mid-month check-ins. So that'll be fun. And yeah, you guys have a great week and take very good care of yourselves. And God bless.